What's going on everybody? David here. It's Tuesday, so we're going to do another quick tip in Premiere Pro. First off, if you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you can get future updates on my videos. Okay, so we're going to be working on the timeline here, and I just want to show you how to link and unlink uh, clips. It's the easiest way to do it. So there are two different ways that you can do this, and you see if I select something, it's going to show me what's linked together. So if uh, I select this, I select the video track here, it's going to show me that the audio track is is linked to it. If I select the video clip up here, you see the audio track is not linked to it. Okay, and same here. Video track, audio track. So they're not linked together. So the easiest way to do it, or let, let me show you the way that I used to do it. So, uh, and I do these videos every Tuesday, and the reason that I do it is because I started making all these YouTube videos and all the different little tips that I learned I'm starting to just do a little quick tip just so you guys can see kind of how I do my workflow so situations like this uh, if I click on let's say I want to link this one and this one down here so if I want to link them together I hit that I hold the shift key and then I select this one down here now, now they're both selected and the old way that I used to do is I would right click come up here to link and then that's how it would link to link them together and you see they're linked together now so these are linked and these are linked now let me unlink it just by hitting right right the uh, right uh, mouse button and then left click and then there you go so now they're unlinked okay so what I want to do now is I want to show you how the easiest way to do it so if you hit the shift key and you select both of them again the same way now all I need to do is hit control L and they're linked together okay so there you go now you're linked now let's say I'm in a situation where everything is just unlinked and another thing too is if I want to unlink them so let, let's say like in this case they're linked this case they're linked if I hit the control L again now it's going to unlink them you see how I did that so if I want to unlink this control L it unlinks that as well so let's say I want to link these all together so I want to link this one this one this one and this one so I want to link all those together so if I hold the shift key down click that one click that one and click that one so I left clicked all those now I want to link them all together control L now they're all linked if I want to move them around I can move them around and they're all linked together so that is the easiest way to do it when it comes to linking and unlinking so if I want to unlink now control L now I've unlinked everything so you see how that works um, it's a quick tip it's easy it's something that I do all the time uh, you might be in certain situations where you need to unlink something let's say uh, I do a lot of uh, different camera angles and I want to unlink the audio uh, let's say I have three different camera angles I want to unlink the audio in two of them and just use the audio for one uh, this is a good situation where you would you would want to unlink something so if you guys have any questions please post them below if you like this video please give me a thumbs up please subscribe for more and I'll talk to you next Tuesday bye